Hello, my beautiful people. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. Welcome back to my channel, to all of my new subscribers, my old subscribers. Thank you all so very, very much. Let's get on with this awesome haul from my hidden Dollar Tree. Um, down in Raleigh. Okay, this is, I guess I'm going to call it part two. Oh, y'all. This is going to be kind of like a little collective haul because most of the stuff that you're seeing here, I got from the brand new um, Dollar Tree down in Raleigh. And then I did a small little food line haul. And I hope I got everything because y'all know, it's been days. <laughs> this stuff's just been sitting here. So let's start over here. I found these Munster Pops. They had blue raspberry and they had pink lemonade. And y'all know how much I love my blue raspberry. These things are ginormous, y'all. I mean, look at this. 12 Monster Pop Sour Blue Raspberry Lemonade. And it just says, artificially and naturally flavored, gluten-free. And you get 12 three ounce. These things are huge, y'all. Look at these. I love these things. I may never um, do the cups again. And it just says budget saver on here. So I was like, oh my God, I can't believe I found these. And I did see them again at the store at the Dollar Tree in Franklinton. So I know that I don't have to go as far until my store gets them. If my store gets them, I hope they do. But if they don't, I don't have to go that far. Like all the way to Raleigh to get them. I can just go to Franklinton. So that's like 12 minutes away. And then I got some. Pack, two packs of my chicken. And vegetable pot stickers. Because I have not had these in a while. And I love these. And I think I'm going to make them for dinner. Either tonight or tomorrow. Along with some um, broccoli. And some. Uh, chicken broth. That's the way I make mine. And then I found this. This is crumbled feta cheese at the store in Raleigh. And I've never ever seen the Dollar Tree carry feta or blue cheese. Um, so I was very happy to find this because I know it's stinky poo poo. But honey, I love me some feta and blue cheese on my salad. So we'll put that stuff in the freezer in a minute. And then I found something I have been looking for for a while. And that was my... <gasps> Trolls Laffy Taffy. Yes, y'all. I found my Troll Laffy Taffy's the World Tour Laffy Taffy. And it says jokes on every wrapper. And it'll tell you on this side what you get in there. And you get strawberry cream, pineapple, apple pie, coconut, orange, and dark cherry. What? <laughs> I love my Laffy Taffy, y'all. Oh, my God. I could not believe I found it. And this, of course, is in the new store down in Raleigh. And then I found these little snack packs of Wisp. Never heard of them before. Never seen them. So, this one was Parmesan cheese crisps. One carb, nine proteins, gluten-free. And they look like these. Okay. And the expiration date was... 3rd, 25, 2021. Let's see if it'll focus. There we go. 3rd, 25, 2021. And then it had this kind. I wish I had gotten more. I only picked up two, one of each. Then they had this one. Cheddar. What does that say? Cello, cheddar, cello cheese, nothing else. And it says Wisp Cheddar Cheese Crisp. And so I just picked up one of each of these. And this is February 4th, 2021. So that expires on that. So I'm excited to try those. It's just a small little, <laughs> you know, little package. 0.63 ounce of crackers. Look, look, kind of look like rice cakes. But they feel flat to me when I'm filling through the paper. So... I got those, and then I just picked up this one little small bag of my shelled pistachios because I love pistachios, and these are just, you know, I didn't feel like picking the shells because then I mess up my nails, so I just got one of those, and then I found something else new. I found this Nature's Garden. It says, Powered by Plants. 
It's a multi-pack of four individual servings, and it says Mountain Trail Mix, and it's a blend of salted peanuts, raisins, M&Ms, milk chocolate candies, salted almonds, and salted cashews. 130 calories, 4 grams of uh, protein, and it says contains 4 bags, 1 ounce. So that was really interesting, and I had not seen that before. An expiration date is 7-01-21. So, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. 7-0-1-21. And I, got, I did get two bags of that because I never saw those before. And I think, oh, these are great little snacks for me to munch on, you know, right before I'm going to bed. I don't know why, but I always feel like I need something to munch on. And then I found these king size Nutter Butter Cookies. And they had several kinds. I think they had Chips Ahoy. Oreos, I think it was. I forgot. It's coming up in a short clip where you'll see it. That they had these little packages of cookies down the kids' snack aisle for back to school. And of course, I just got a nutter butter because who doesn't love a nutter butter? Anything with peanut butter, I'm there. And then I found these cute, cute little snack packs of olives. And I'm almost positive I've seen these before, that they've had these before. But I can't remember because y'all know I go to the Dollar Tree entirely too much. So these are Lindsay Medium Mild and Nutty Black Ripe Pitted Olives. And it just says 60 calorie snack. And they look like this. And I don't know, you guys. The date is not, um, the date, the best buy is 91921. That's September, and this one is August 3rd, um, 2021. So I was uh, very, very interested in trying these. So, yeah. And then I found, finally found the Forbes Watermelon Taffy and the Creamsicle Taffy. Now, I have not tried the Creamsicle yet, but I did try the Watermelon and it was good, but it wasn't as good as my Laffy Taffy, y'all. And I have been looking for this forever. <laughs> I do me <mean> forever. <laughs> so, I was a little disappointed because I bought three bags of each. But, not to worry. My sisters and them will like that. So, I'll probably give them each a bag. Something like that. But, yeah, I finally did find them, you guys. I was so excited. <laughs> so, and I did find this pack of... Um, Nature's Grain Hawaiian Dinner Rolls 6 pack and I ate the rolls already because I made some homemade egg salad and that egg salad was the bomb on these little rolls and they were so good and so fresh you guys. I don't know what be making me think when I'm doing things. I should have gotten at least two packs but you know I'm not supposed to be eating bread so that's probably what did it. I just wanted to try one. And they were very, very fresh and just absolutely delicious. If I run across them again, you know, I will buy, I will repurchase these because they were small enough for me to have without going over my carb intake. And they were just so delicious. <laughs> so then, -hoo -hoo, my score of the day, my score of the day was my red truck mat. Now, the only, I did everything in my power to keep these things from bending, cracking, <laughs> and getting them home so that they, they could be in pristine shape so they weren't ruined, folded, or nothing. I wouldn't let the guy put them in any, I made him bag them all alone flat, and then I made sure I sat them in my car on a flat surface, and then when I brought them in the house, they've been on a flat surface ever since. But I got a bonus with these mats. I got four of them because they had them hidden underneath the other mats. These are so gorgeous, y'all. Look at this. When it comes to fall time, I'm going to have a heyday. But I did not notice. Now, I go online all the time. I try to see what they have coming out. I saw the pot holders. I saw the oven mitt. I saw the dish towels, which I got two of each, ready for my holiday decorum. But I did not know that they had the washcloths. And they had my favorite ones, y'all. They had the scrubber dishcloths. I was like, oh, bonus. <laughs> 
Well, I could not believe I found two. I got the whole set now, y'all. I'm so excited. Unless they come out with a tablecloth or something else. Right now, I do have the whole set, and I'm so happy. I do wish I had bought more washcloths, but I will be definitely going back to that Dollar Tree when I get a day off. Like, I have the next four days off. One of those days, I'll probably go back up there. But I'm trying to restrain from the Dollar Tree and let other people show what's new out there. I've got mounds and mounds of of friend mail that I need to get out. And I can't get this friend mail out if I'm constantly going to the Dollar Tree buying more stuff. I saw my sofa for the first time in weeks. Weeks, y'all. I actually stretched out on my sofa last night because I finally got all the friend mail off my sofa. I am trying to get to doing my plants within the next four days that I'm off. I already planted one and the, um, she's coming up really, really nice. I can't wait until she blooms. I miss one day of watering, not watering my plants and they look like crap. You've got to water these plants every day. But this is the one that I just started and look, look at the seedlings in there. Can y'all see? I can't wait until she comes up. So, yeah, I came out here earlier to water the plants and I got like three or four mosquito bites right away. So, we're going to go back in the house real quick. Because I'm getting ready to make me some dinner. But, yeah, I've got hauls everywhere. Hauls everywhere. <laughs> but the first thing I got to do is get this friend mail out. And then... We will start shopping at the Dollar Tree again because I'm so happy that of the stuff that I got, I got most of my wish, um, wish list items. And then when I was on my way home, I stopped up at Food Line and I got me some almond milk, some unsweet. I drank the sweetened one at the Dollar Tree. It's okay, but I really, really like the unsweet. And of course, you know, I've got my list on my Walmarts, but I just haven't had a chance to actually send it to check out because I keep adding stuff on. I bought nine bottles of uh, diet tonic water, but I already put two in the refrigerator. Yeah, and then I found some Markdown uh, boneless beef sirloin steak. Just every now and then I like to get me a little piece of beef, and I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with this yet. Probably just put it on my George Foreman grill. And then I bought a nice piece of beautiful looking watermelon, watermelon. I got my distilled water. And I believe that's it, you guys. I'm so confused. <laughs> but I want to say thank you to all of you who have been loyal in supporting my channel. You have no idea how much I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you so very much. I hope you all have a blessed day. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And see you guys later. Bye.